what do we have here? So I say thrift. What's up, guys? Coming at you with another video. Back in a minute. I haven't recorded in a while. Uh, got, got the day off today. It's Thursday, the 28th. Uh, I'm not sure when I'll upload this video. Maybe I'll upload this before. I have a couple of videos just waiting to be uploaded, uh, edited. But as you can see, there's a lot of red here. I went to the thrift. I was out and uh, close to the thrift. No, let me hit it up. I got there right when it opened and um, looking for some specific stuff. And I found some specific stuff. Because uh, you can see a lot of red. Let's get into it. First time here, the Super Life Super Thrift. Oh, the good, li good life. Good life of super thrift. <laughs> My bad. I can't read. First stop, the shoes. First time at this thrift. Uh, I'm going to kind of check it out. I really expected much, but we're going to see what's up. Kind of the layout. The furniture section over here, the back of the store. First thing, first rack. Oh, Buccaneers. Second find, it's a Bucks life. <laughs> Not bad. Today's theme at the thrift for the thrift hall is polos. Basically, it's polos. Uh, this one I found out found at the Super Thrift 2 wick 2x retails 35 oh what whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I thought that was a little snag right there but it's a little little crease 1099 50 off all men's so it came up like 550 brand new can't beat it with a nice Adidas polo it's probably gonna wear to church tomorrow next one I got here Nike golf with the little Nike on the, on the side this is the same uh, material that I got my uh, the maroon one last time. I got caught this one for three ninety five. Everything was uh, fifty percent off except for the yellow tag. Of course, this is the yellow tag. And last but not least, Perry Ellis polo. Same kind of material, kind of that dry fit material. Very clean for my uh, dress down Fridays at work. Three days later. First thing I have right here is a Carnell Williams, Cadillac Williams jersey. This looks like a women's jersey, uh, size extra large. So this could fit my, um, probably fit my mom or even my girlfriend. I'm not sure, depending on the sizing of these. So um, definitely had to pick this up. Very, uh, real, really clean. No big uh, flaws or anything like that. I believe I have a jersey of his um, somewhere in the closet. Definitely, definitely the first thing I saw was this logo right here, the Buccaneers logo. If you guys don't know, see my previous video when I went to Tampa, visited the, some of the Bucks um, facilities. Um, favorite team right here. Now going back to the jersey, um, today they had a blue and yellow tag sale, 50% off. So this one's blue. So this one came out a little bit over 250 with tax. Next up, I got this Publix t-shirt. This is a extra large, I believe. Yeah. Uh, $1.99 wasn't on sale um pretty clean pretty clean not um i mean the graphics on this is pretty really clean so you know just around the house shirt i'm not an extra large i'm a double x right now but you know how it works out i'm gonna be extra large pretty soon definitely have to pick that up next one i have up is a large uh kids tee it's a 14 16 says on tag Tampa bay buccaneers another decent looking shirt uh, the thing, uh, the reason I got this one is my girls, instead of uh, getting into um, pajamas and stuff, they like to just wear big t-shirts to bed. So this is definitely you know, a nice little pajama for one of them, uh, for the bigger one that I have. Um, this next one that I have are two two polos that I kind of debated about getting. These are really faded. The only reason I got them, this one doesn't even look like it's a name brand. Um, but the reason I got them was because of the logo What I'll do is I'll figure out um, how to take this out. I'll probably just cut it out And uh, attach it to something I, I do have uh, an army an army uh, What is it like a bucket hat? I have an official um, Patch that I can iron on I'm gonna I'll show you guys that maybe later and 
So probably, the reason that's why the reason I got that one. This one looks like an official NFL polo. I don't know if you could tell or not, but this one's really faded. This is a size large. These were $2.99 each. So I decided um, let me just pick these up. I could use probably use these logos for something else. Um, shit, maybe even uh, maybe somebody will wear them. But uh, yeah, two polos. Uh, the shirts over there, everything came out to a good 11.32. Now one of the jersey was 50% off, and then I had a 15% off coupon that I applied to this, so it came out to 11 bucks. Not bad. So this is the patch I was talking about earlier. Um, this is, looked like an official patch. I forgot where I got this from, to be honest. I might have ordered it, ordered it, um, but definitely a um, really clean patch. I can get in there. Um, it's, it's a little sticky. It was on something. I forgot what it was, uh, where I got it from, but, you know, nevertheless, this is the, um, the bucket hat or the hat that I have. Of course, I got this from the Thrift 2, uh, a while back. Definitely clean. Uh, I think this is a de desert camo. Um, uh, but this is what I had envisioned. So this is what I kind of had envisioned, uh, to wear out to the, uh, Dolphins and Bucks game. It's definitely going to be a little sunny out here in Florida. You know how it gets down and uh gotta get the protection but definitely had this in mind um put the logo up on there on the hat real quick i don't see no you don't see nobody with one of these i mean unless they custom made it but i never seen one of these for sale with the bucks logo on it so um definitely trying to make that happen we'll catch up definitely gonna get try to get some footage uh when we tailgate out there for the dolphins game on november 19th um was postponed due to these crazy ass hurricanes around here but yeah this is what this is what the um this is what the vision is. We'll see how it turns out.